All right. Oh, cool. That egg that hatched. One of those little rays. Neat. Um, what were we going to build? I don't remember. Ooh, we need, definitely need one of these. So, advanced wiring kit. Computer chip. We have the wiring kit. That's right. That's what we were going to do. So we need another wiring kit. Also built a nuclear reactor after the stream, but I learned that I did not like how it sounded. It's too loud. So I built a secondary area of my base. Power everything. What's up, Kuda? Water filtration, that's right. Rubies. Ruby, bell sack, copper wire. Wait, rubies are here. Gel sacks are outside. Also started my uh, salad grow house. <laughs> Thank you. But welcome aboard, Captain. The uh made this little offshoot here for the nuclear power reactor. Just because that is so loud. Like it drowns out the jukebox. Which? <clears throat> what 
are you up to today, Kuda? Or tonight? This morning? Um... I already forgot what I was doing. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Water filtration. Copper wire. place another habitat module on top of this. I don't think, I think the moon pool is going to obstruct it, yeah. That's unfortunate. I wanted to put another one here. Maybe we go triple decker. our aquarium up to three stories as well. What you got? What you got? Come here. Come here.
one more. on this side on this level We have a shower. Oh, we just need titanium for the rest of our bathroom. Although, probably ship at the bathroom here, maybe put the office upstairs. That would make more sense. It'll give me that. But it won't give it to me here. That's annoying.
Where's the shell? Am I blind? Oh, I also wanted to build a fridge. Here it is. So yes, yes I am blind. Slightly misaligned bit. Uh, why'd you have to say something? Uh. Damn you, Kuda. Seek fluid intake. I'll give you your fluid intake. There we go. Weird glitching shelf there. See if we can fix that with a replacement. Nope. Oh, it's just gonna be glitchy. Maybe we put it over here instead. back over our bed. E. Be going on. Let's see. Walls. Titanium. Really? You just gave me salt. So cheated. Vital signs stabilizing. So we got our charge fins going. So many sea monkeys. Thank you. Huh. Wow. They just go around and just picked up. Pick, they picked up my light. Little bastards. Let's see. 
go to the scanner room. Titanium. Wondering, do the mines respawn? I think the sea truck's the way to go on this one. when the uh, truck is attached to the front. All the titanium that I've dropped while out searching for things.
Maybe we can find some fragments to de deconstruct as well. I know there's a lot of grab balls in this area. See? Thank you. Maybe searching for Galena. Because we'll either get lead or. Uh, titanium, which both we'll always be able to use. Inventory full. Where is my truck? Dude, where's my car? There you Stream Raiders battle that's ready. Let's see how many troops we have uh, placed. troops on this one. Oops, Saul. How you doing? We might not make this one. We did not win. Feels bad, man. That's the first one we've lost. All right, let's try it again. Back to the game. I've watched this game before, seen some sub gameplay, but not Below Zero. In my opinion, I mean, while Below Zero is not quite finished, they should, uh, they said that they're hoping to have it finished early this year. I'm liking it more than the base game of Sonatica. The vehicles are better. The... Uh, maybe a little bit darker on the 
base. Yes. Yes. That Darth Vader look. Um Attention, we are being followed. Shall I dispatch the, the vehicles? Are better, in my opinion. Um, the prawn is the prawn. I mean, that's it's pretty much the same. But the seed truck, it takes the sea moth and the cyclops and, and, and merges them together, basically. It's a much better vehicle, and you're not like having to choose between which one to take out. So much better, in my opinion. Wait. Let's drop this egg. See what it hatches into. Hopefully they don't eat everything. And this addition, the base building is so much more fun in my opinion. You got so much room now. There are some things I wish they would change. Like being able to place doors on any wall segment. These small fish you could use in sub. Oh, there's tons of fish. But there's even an aquarium module for the sea truck, which catches fish as you drive along. It's not gonna work because of the ladder. Yep, it's a nice food source. Exactly. Although, I'm at a point where I really don't have to worry about food anymore because I have this new recipe that's in the game that uh, pretty much takes care of any issues. And then my grow, grow beds downstairs are basically a farm for those materials. All right, basically what we're doing here is we're building a bathroom. As you hear the uh, the music, that's all in the game. There's a jukebox for your bass. Ah, uh, can't put that on the wall. Sad. You gotta have some plants in the bathroom. So you can plant stuff in it. Grab a dub dub. Okay.
Yeah, I've got a triple decker aquarium going, or alien containment going on. This, uh, below zero has these large chambered rooms. I tell algae will fix the occasional cravings for thyme salmon steak drizzled with lemon butter sauce. <laughs> now, it's not uh, algae based. Basically, you take the leaves of this plant, not the berries. The berries are what you plant. And the peppers off these. Let's just grab a bunch of these peppers. In order to make spicy fruit salad. Surprising delicious salad with a with warming effects. So this entire planet's frozen. Or I don't know if the entire planet's frozen or if we're just in the Arctic side of things. But that being said. In addition to the hunger and thirst of previous of the previous game, you now have to worry about your body temperature. To having something to warm you up a nice little addition but these ret return 85 food 30 water and give you 100 body heat so, and from what I can tell, they don't decay. So, need some glass. as big as I thought it would be. That's good, though. Nice. We can put all our finished foods in there. And if we... Have some stuff we don't want to decay. We can throw it in there as well. Nice. All right. What else did we want to build? everything I was looking to build. Uh, I don't think we'll be able to put a bulkhead here. Yeah. It's only in long hallways, but we have a long hallway here. Grab some silicone rubber. that is either. I'm going to end up putting something in here that eats everything else, I'm sure.
And let's make some more silicone rubber. Hmm. <laughs> what you got? Come here. Get out of the vines. Oh. <laughs> if you walk away from him. <laughs> he acts all dejected and just hangs his head in sadness. It's funny. Welcome aboard, Captain. But when you first start the game, you, uh, there's little sea monkeys is what they're called. They, uh, not really hostile, but they'll come up to you, act all cute, and they'll steal the tools in your hat right out of your hands. And you have to chase them down and get them back. After something happens in the game, no spoilers, they become friendly and they'll bring you things. Bulkhead, that's what I was doing. I have the memory of a goldfish. More titanium? I don't have any more titanium. Damn it. Like cute aquatic pegomastics. An arc? I don't have too much experience with arcs, so I'm not familiar with the pegomastics. But if that's what they did, then yes. I've got the, this in, this song on loop, but there's different songs that play on the uh, jukebox. You can find different song discs. One could say CDs <laughs> that uh, will work with the jukebox. Sneak thieves will spot you, scamper up, steal something, run away over his shoulder with a bag in his hands. Yeah, that sounds about right. They're just little playful things. Alright, we can turn that off now. Be ready to go back out again. I feel like I'm forgetting something though. Let's get some food and put it in our sea truck. So need to attach our prawn eggs. Where's my prawn? 
There you are. Welcome aboard, Captain. There. Yeah, this is our aquarium our sea truck aquarium so as we drive around it catches fish that we can use to cook our fabricator module so we can gather our resources and then craft them straight here All right, we can turn that off we don't need the greenhouse for a little bit I think Which one of these is the closest? 892. That's really close. All right, Q59. These are aggressive. I've seen someone defend their army or defend their base with an army of them. They were stripping the raiders of the ammo and C4 and armor and weapons and everything. Poor guys were hiding naked in the hallway. <laughs> oh yeah, the, this game has just a beautiful everything and beautifully terrifying on some things. as terrifying as some of the leviathans were in subnautica they went beyond above and beyond for below zero i don't i haven't seen everything yet so 